Hey, what's up? It's Alex. Today we're going to look at the connected readings in a sample of ordinary English from a restaurant review that I found online. Let's take a look. This restaurant looks so generic and boring from the outside. This restaurant, restaurant, we don't pronounce that A-U in the middle, restaurant, looks so, looks so, we connect those two S sounds, looks so generic and boring. And boring becomes and boring. That D at the end of and, some speakers do different things with this. I personally make it a very, very weak D. My tongue is in position to say D, but it doesn't really say it. It just goes straight to B. And boring. And boring. And boring. So generic and boring from the outside that I didn't go for years. From the outside, the out, the out, the outside, we put a Y there. From the outside, that I didn't go for years. That I, that I, we link those two words together, and the final T in that turns into a flap. That I, that I didn't go, didn't, didn't, that's a glottal stop instead of a T at the end. Didn't go for years, for years. For turns into fur, for years. Assuming that it was an overpriced tourist trap. That it wasn't, that it wasn't. It's funny to me how all those four words kind of combine into one very quick thing because they're not the focus of the sentence. That it wasn't. Assuming that it was an overpriced, assuming that it was an over, that it was an, that it was an overpriced tourist trap. Overpriced tourist trap. The D and T connect together, and then the T and T connect together. Overpriced tourist trap. Now, some people say tourist. I say tourist. This is one of those words that has multiple acceptable pronunciations in American English. Tourist trap. Tourist trap. I say tourist trap. I finally went, and I was very pleasantly surprised. Went. That T at the end turns into a glottal stop. I finally went, and I was very pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly. There's another glottal stop T there. Pleasantly surprised. Surprised. Not surprised, but surprised. I got the seafood plate. I got the seafood plate. I got the. Got the. We connect those T's together. Got the. Got the seafood plate that had. That had. That had. That turns into a very, very short word. That. That. That had, that had two, that had two, that had two, D and T connect together. Two of the best shrimp I've ever eaten. Two of the best shrimp. Now, of the, we could say, of the, or of the. Two of the best, two of the best, two of the best shrimp. But that T in best disappears, and the two S sounds connect. Best shrimp. Two of the best shrimp I've ever eaten. 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 We have a glottal stop there. Eaten. A crab cake. Grilled fish. Grilled fish. Again, that D kind of weakens before that F sound. Grilled fish. Grilled fish. Grilled fish. And mashed Okinawan sweet potato. And mashed. Now that D disappears because we connect the N with M. And mashed and mashed, and mashed Okinawan. Now, with mashed Okinawan, the D sound is pronounced completely, but it's connected to the next syllable. Mashed Okinawan, mashed Okinawan sweet potato. Mashed Okinawan sweet potato. That T in sweet turns into a glottal stop. Sweet potato, sweet potato. All over a Thai coconut cream sauce. Same thing for the T in coconut coconut cream sauce. It's a little bit expensive. Little bit expensive. Little bit expensive. Bit expensive. It's a tap, and it's kind of hard to say. Little bit expensive. Little bit expensive. We had two taps there. One in little, and the other in bit. Bit expensive. Little bit expensive. Little bit expensive. 
for what you get compared to other places. For what you get. For what you get. For what you get. For what you get. Now, even though you is a pronoun, that's an important word, we still don't really stress it here. For what you. For what you. For what you. Because the stress is going to be on get. For what you get. For what you get compared to other places. Get. That T disappears, turns into a glottal stop. Get compared to, get compared to other places. Compared to, and those D and T sounds link together, and the vowel in to reduces to a. Uh. Compared to, compared to other places. Compared to other places. Now, right there, I did a linking sound between to other, to other, or to other. To other. You can put the linking sound in or you can choose to leave it out. It's your decision. Compared to other places. Compared to other places. They both sound just fine to me. But I still look forward to going back. But I, we tap that T in but I, still look. Connect those L sounds together. Still look forward to, forward to. Now we have that same thing where two connects with forward. T, forward t, forward to going back. This restaurant looks so generic and boring from the outside that I didn't go for years, assuming that it was an overpriced tourist trap. I finally went, and I was very pleasantly surprised. I got the seafood plate that had two of the best shrimp I've ever eaten, a crab cake, grilled fish, and mashed Okinawan sweet potato, all over a Thai coconut cream sauce. It's a little bit expensive for what you get compared to other places, but I still look forward to going back.